Hello guys, I welcome you all on this wonderful platform that is by Juice Exam Prep. So as gate exam is over, results are about to come. So I would like to tell you that uh, now generally students are appearing for gate either for PSUs or for IIT MTech admissions or RIT MTech admissions. You know, first uh, like IIT and ISC admissions are starting just after the gate score and even ISC is giving notification during the exam days only. So today I will be telling you about ISC notification for MTech admissions. This time a new category is also added like without gate score. Uh, there is a CFTI mode which is also there for MTech admissions. So I will be telling you about the normal like with the gate how you can apply and with the CFTI mode also both things I will be telling you about this. Uh, you can see in this video. First of all let us talk about the normal MTech admissions which are from the gate score. So this is MTech and MDES program. For that they have already mentioned a lot of things that the institute offers the master's program based on the coursework like MTech is also there. Master of Design MDES is also there and Master of Management is also there. And if you see uh, like the institute admits about 450 students every year and in that 50 sponsored candidates from various government agencies and PSUs are also there. So I would like to tell you like what they are asking for. They are asking that the department and center participating in August 24 admissions are listed above, uh, sorry listed below. And they are saying that your BE or BTEC should be completed by 1st August 2024 for this MTech program and you must have a qualified and hold valid gate scorecard. Hold valid gate score means if you have appeared for gate last year then for three years gate score is valid. So that validity should be there for applying. They have also mentioned that you should apply through online admission application portal instruction for portals are given and we will use the common offer acceptance portal like scope is there for IIT and ISC counseling. So they are also saying that okay and now I would like to tell you that ki what are the various program like you want to check the various programs like MDES program master of design under that you are having product design development and management okay and discipline product design development and management these are disciplines department will be design and manufacturing intake is 18 and they are saying qualify qualification required for like gate paper is there and BE BTEC or equivalent degree in any discipline with valid gate score and weightage wise 70 percent weightage will be given to the gate 30 percent performance in the interview. I would like to tell you ISC is always giving some particular weightage like 30 percent here they are giving for the interview. At our time sometimes they were conducting written test also okay. So like I have shown you for MDES likewise their MTech are there I am showing you one two programs rest you can check like for aerospace you can see 19 intakes are there they are also mentioning which gate score they will refer. Like for gate paper code A E aerospace like C E C H E C double E M E and X E. So even if you appeared for X E then also you will be eligible for this. Similarly you can check artificial intelligence, bioengineering, civil engineering, chemical engineering all the branches are mentioned. You just need to you just need to click on this like I will be clicking on this they will be showing 21 intakes are there. What are the various discipline M E A E P I X E okay. So likewise you can check okay all the things all the things. So guys now I am coming on to the important deadlines like the dates okay. So what is the date? The date if you see they are mentioning for PG and research programs the application came on 5th of February last date to apply if you are applying with the gate that is 22nd March and uh, we are not talking about if you talk about sponsored candidate. Uh, sponsored candidates from PSUs or from some government organization for them it is 12th of April and then we are talking about the written test schedule. Written test schedule is going to be 15th to 19th April like I said sometime they go with the written test sometime they go with the interview sometime combined things okay. So those combined weightage is 30 marks. So MTech MDES program regular aptitude test or interview they have mentioned that is 15th to 19th April management program is 15 to 19 April MSc life size that is 15 to 17 April after that research interview schedule they are saying for interdisciplinary program 10 11 May research program 13 17 May PhD program 20 May so we are talking about majorly MTech not PhD okay so we have already discussed now these are for those students who are already in the PSUs or research organization so we are not going into that. So I already told you main important dates are you need to apply before 22nd March 
then you will be having written test between 15 to 19 the prayer okay written test or interview or both whatever depends on the number of application they are going with okay so this is the way you can apply guys and after going to the important dates after going to the important dates i will be telling you about uh, that fee structure click here to view so when we are talking about the fee structure for fee structure also they have mentioned like fee structure scholarship or fellowship so for pg or phd program when you will be applying for general obc ws 800 rupees for sc sc pwd is 400 okay then guys you can see about the uh, like uh, mtech research uh, you can see this is the scholarship you will be getting 12400 rupees so for mtech mdes you will get scholarship of 12400 rupees so this everybody would be aware of also so guys this is uh, related to the fee structure you can see for structure fee structure if you talk about for general category also it is mentioned for sc st category also it is mentioned so this is the fee structure for uh, research program this is for m tech m des and m management so you can see uh, this general obc ws category this is the fee structure you can see 20200 29200 okay for a general and SCST category for management the fees is more so I am talking about MTech I am not talking about the management course because we are talking from the gate okay so I feel everybody understood this okay yes fine guys so now I would like to tell you like whenever we are going to this post graduate programs there you are also having a new mode this year that new mode is from the CFTI MTech through CFTI mode Okay, what is this CFTI mode? Now let us talk about that. So when we are talking about the CFTI mode, this time this CFTI graduates with a minimum duration of four years with specialization as mentioned for each participating MTech discipline with CGP of 8.0 directly to MTech from the academic year 24-25. For the first time from some central universities, like previously they were giving this to only IIT students. If a IIT BTEC student want to appear for MTech in ISC or any IIT without gate score, he can directly enter if his CGPA is more than 8. But that was only for IITs previously. Now they, have, they are allowing other institute students also. And they have also mentioned the list of the institutes which are coming under this CFTI. Okay. And they can appear. And they are mentioning that department and center participating for this admissions are listed below. And they have also mentioned candidate can apply to a maximum of three disciplines for MTech programs and that selection will be based on career analysis marks and performance in the interview. So if you see this CFTI mode, you can see important deadlines we will see later on. First of all, let us see what are the various, uh, you can say, disciplines where you can apply. For that, first is artificial intelligence, okay. So for artificial intelligence, the departments which are conducting is electrical, computer science, computational data and all these mentioned. Intake is 9, qualification is BTEC 4 years, okay, or they are also saying that have done a formal course in programming of C and C++. Then selection process 70% is career analysis marks means your BTEC percentage and all. 30% will be performance in the written test, like there it was 70% gate. And they are saying the areas of studies are also mentioned. Second, you can go for computational and data sciences. Okay. And third, you can go for like ECE discipline, then electronic system. Then you can go for electronic product design, mechanical engineering. So all those which were there, similarly here also some disciplines are there. And there you can apply if you are fulfilling that criteria. Okay. So all these branches are mentioned. So this is a wonderful thing I would like to say that, okay. So now I am coming on to this. Uh, that is centrally funded technical institutes, what I was saying the CFTI. If you want to see that list of institutes that you should be a student of which institute to apply for CFTI. So this is centrally funded technical institutes and you can see they are saying what is required. For admission CFTI graduate and it is required that you should have a CGP of 8 out of 10, okay. That is a requirement and they are also saying that that IITs you can see all 23 IITs are coming in this list then 
you are having list of IIMs, okay, the students from IIMs, then the list of IISCRs, you know that. So you can see Kolkata, Pune, Mohali, Bhopal, Tirupati, Bairampur, then list of NITs, you can see these are NIT, Agartala, Allahabad, Bhopal, Kalikat, Durgapur. So all those institutes which are funded by the government, uh, central government, so you can see all these institutes are there. Then the list of triple ITs are there, okay. Then after that we are also having the NIT, TTRs and then you can see some other central institutes. Okay, so this 122, okay, you can see these are the number of institutes. If you are a student of any of these, you can directly apply for CFTI mode even if you have not qualified the gate examination. So this time the student can appear with the gate score, without gate score. If you are going with the gate score, 70% weightage for gate, 30% for interview. If you are going for this CFTI courses, 70% for your carrier, marks means your BTEC percentage and all. Okay, carrier analysis performance, I feel CAM. Okay, I don't remember the full form. <laughs> okay, so let us see now. Uh, we will see like here, there was a important deadline for this. So important deadline for CFTI is, you can see the last date for online submission will be uh, 2nd March, this is for normal program. For CFTI program, website opens on 20th March, last date of submission is 29th April, okay. So I feel a lot of time is given for that, okay. So rest detail we have already seen. So guys, I feel all the students who are looking for masters from IISC, Bangalore, they can apply now or if you are thinking like gate exam is already over, you would be having an idea how many marks you are getting and you can match with the last year's uh, cutoffs uh, and if your marks are lying in that range, then definitely you can apply now also. If you want to wait for the results, then also they are giving you proper time for that purpose, okay. So I feel uh, this is for that video. And goodbye guys, we will be soon coming up uh, for the IITs, admission video, COPE, uh, CCMT, all other details will be coming shortly. So just stay tuned with us and subscribe if you have not done yet and like and share this video. Goodbye guys for this particular session.